Hi guys, so in this video, I'm just going to be showing you how to create a NAND backup using BootMe. Uh, to do this, you'll need the BootMe files on your SD card. You might already have those. If you don't, you can create them using ModMe for Windows, or you can run the Hackme installer. And uh, go to the BootMe option, then prepare SD card. Uh, to launch BootMe, just go to Launch BootMe after hitting the Home button on the Homebrew channel. Then the screen should come up. Uh, you can use the power button on your Wii to select your option. Your option will be highlighted. So just push the power button to change it. You want to go to the one with the uh, gears right there. Uh, yeah, select that with the reset button. You want uh, to go to that one, the one with the arrow going to the SD card. It's NAND backup. If you want to restore it, you can use that one, arrow going to the NAND from the SD card. So uh, just hit the power button, go to backup, and hit reset to select it. Okay, so it'll either start backing up now or give you this screen. I already have a NAND up in on my SD card, which is why it gave me this. I just have to hit the reset button to start the NAND backup. There we go. Yeah, so if you already had the uh, NAND up bin on your SD card, then you would have had that screen. If you didn't, it would just go right to this screen. Hey guys, one other thing I forgot to mention is that uh, if you get a bad block while backing up your Wii, that's completely normal. I'm probably going to get one right here. Right uh, there. That's a bad block. And that's completely normal. I have a few of them on my Wii. I'm not sure how many. Uh, but yeah, it's completely normal uh, to have a few of them. If you have like 20 or 40, then that's kind of getting bad. But a few of them is perfectly fine. So uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day.